he's beyond what everyone else is doing. This performer is on a completely different level. Him on a synthesizer is like Picasso painting. I'm Mike Testa. Uh, I'm a visiting professor here at the Sound Recording Technology Department, and we invited Jordan Rudess from Dream Theater. Even though I turned into this rocker guy, metal, prog, keyboardist, and Dream Theater. I rely upon my education. I was invited to, to do this, uh, I think, because, you know, a combination of what I kind of been doing with my life, which is, you know, the performing world, but also I'm very involved with technology. Wouldn't it be really cool to show the students, you know, somebody that's, that's really cool. taking technology yeah, and making it commercially viable and, you know, having success with it? I really wanted to play drums, so I figured, if I can make a machine that did all the work and just a game controller, I'm all set. Hi, I'm Alicia. Good, how are you? Good. I had no idea that we'd have anybody ever come and look at our projects. He played my instrument. He took interest to it. It's nice to know that like you know, heroes that are famous are still people. If one of us stands on this and one of us stands on this and we touch, it produces the sound pre-programmed. If Jordan Rudis is coming here and asking us, questions and showing interest, we can make anything. I really hope that I can provide a little bit of inspiration, you know, on some level. You know, the world of sound is so exciting, there's inspiration there, it's just plain fun. Oh, it's neat. It's all fun. Yeah. <laughs> just being able to show what you're doing to someone who is the expert in what you're learning about, it's just crazy. <laughs> I don't think you needed to be a music aficionado to understand that what you were seeing on stage was something extremely special. And that's something that you don't get every day.